Hey guys, it's summertime here on the Sunshine Coast of Australia, and the male frogs are calling for the female. It's the start of the breeding season and the beginning of the green tree frog life cycle. Have a listen to the frog chorus. They are making quite the racket. This can continue into the early hours of the morning. Loud, aren't they? Unfortunately, the frogs keep laying their eggs in our pool. These are the ones that we collected. Not all of them survived. The tadpoles are 10 days old now. The green tree frog is one of the few frogs that make this croaking call. It sounds quite familiar but is also unique in the frog world. Also, Australian native frogs typically produce 1,000 to 2,000 eggs a year. Frogs are amphibians, which means they have a double life. At a young stage, tadpoles they live in water and breathe through gills. As adults, they breathe with lungs and live on land. However, they need to be around water to breed and keep their skin warm. Also, guys, there are 90 species of frogs in Queensland. The frogs are now 16 days old. Look at those tadpoles. Aren't they so cute? Frogs are an indicator species, which tells us that our environment is healthy. We avoid using chemical fertilizers in our yard so the frogs can have a healthy environment here to live in. The use of chemicals is one of the reasons that the frog population is declining. Did you know that the green tree frog can live up to 20 years old? Although in the wild they don't often reach this age due to predators. Frogs have many predators such as birds, snakes, cats, dogs and cane toads. Other threats for the green tree frogs are loss of habitat and the poisoning of the environment. The tadpoles are now 25 days old and are starting to develop their back legs. Can you see the tiny back legs starting to form? Here the tadpoles are 29 days old and most of them have back legs. The tadpoles are now 30 days old. After 30 days, you can now see that a couple of the tadpoles have developed front legs. The first tadpole has now transformed into a little froglet and has developed lungs for breathing. It's time for her to leave the water and start the journey of being a frog in the wild. Wow, they are starting to turn green. They are 36 days old now. They are starting to look like cute little frogs. What an amazing transformation. Frogs are nocturnal, which means they come out at night to feed. They like to eat bugs, insects and spiders. They are great for helping to control pests such as cockroaches. After 42 days, they all hop out of the bucket and venture off into nature. Okay guys, so this is a frog baby, so you can see that his tail's fallen off and he's very tiny, he's got tiny little spots on him. 
Yeah, the eyes are really tiny, the feet are really tiny, but the suckers have a lot of power. Now, you guys might think that they're a bit slimy. They're not slimy at all. They're really dry. They're very, most of them are shy. Yeah, you should handle them really gently. So, yeah, he is very cute, but also very shy. So you've got to be really careful hand, handling these guys. You don't pat them. You don't, like pat them on the back because they don't like it they're very nice and beautiful they've got yellow spots see, see that he's very very tiny he, he's probably as big as as my knuckle and He's, he's got a very nice pattern on his back. You can see there on his cheeks that it's really nice. Green, light green stripe. Did you know that a group of frogs is called an army? We have an army of frogs in our backyard. An interesting fact about the green tree frog is that its soft green skin secretes compounds with antiviral and antibacterial properties. I hope they can grow to adult frogs so that the green tree frog life cycle can continue. I hope you have enjoyed my presentation about the green tree frog.